Hey there, tech enthusiasts. Welcome back to our channel. Today at my solar home, we've got some intriguing updates on the solar energy front. And it involves two big players, Tesla and GAF. Stick around because you don't want to miss the latest developments on the solar roof tile market front. So let's dive right in. Tesla has been known for its groundbreaking electric cars, solar panels, batteries, and a couple of years back, it even ventured into the solar roof tile space. With its really innovative glass and metal solar roof tile system, Elon Musk touted that and launched it with the goal great is to make have have electric or you know solar roofs that look better than a uh, normal roof, generate electricity, have, last longer, have better insulation, um, and actually have a cost an installed cost that is less than a normal roof plus the cost of electricity. But recent market research from one of the largest market research firms in the U.S. has indicated that over the last two years, only 3,000 solar roofs have been installed in the U.S. That's a far cry from the ambitious goal of manufacturing and installing a thousand roofs per week back in 2019. Elon Musk's own words. Now, Elon Musk, who's Tesla's visionary CEO, has faced many challenges integrating the solar energy business after acquiring Solar City in 2016. Despite his efforts to cut costs and attract new buyers with his new $100 online booking incentives, the Tesla solar panel business lags behind its competitors. It's a distance fourth today. The top three installers are Sunrun, Titan, and Freedom Forever. Not names you might have heard, but Tesla is number four in the solar panels, regular solar panels business. And the much hyped solar roof tiles, which we talked about, they're minuscule 0.03% market share. So they're doing really terribly. And now we have a new player. GAF, the roofing major, has stepped into the solar roof tile arena in 2022 with its GAF Timberline solar shingles. Now GAF's entry into the solar roof market is a little different from Tesla's approach. Tesla's roof tiles involve a full roof replacement with their metal and glass roof tiles. The glass roof tiles produce solar electricity, much smaller like solar panels, and the metal tiles, which are additional, they give the roof additional structural integrity. Now, a regular solar Tesla solar roof tile installation involves a complete roof reinstall. And this makes the Tesla solar roof four to five times more costly than a regular solar panel plus roof install. GAF, on the other hand, has gone the way of designing solar roof shingles, which look like regular asphalt shingles. They're similar sized to Tesla's, but they can be nailed onto the substrate. Installation is easier, cheaper, and the company promises a small premium over a regular solar panel plus you know, new roof installed. But things have not been smooth for GAF either. In 2023, they have a major recall, fire hazard. Some of the electronics on their GAF solar roof tiles are heating up, causing fires. They haven't yet caused a serious fire, but GAF has recalled a huge chunk of the solar roof tiles that they have installed. Both Tesla and GAF they reflect the challenges which are inherent in the solar roof tile technology market. This market demands superb integration. The shingles are small, they don't produce as much energy as larger panels, and yet 
there are far too many shingles on your roof. A single roof tile produces between 65 to 75 watts compared to a standard 400 watt solar panel. Getting all the solar roof tiles talking to each other, passing energy to each other is a huge challenge. There are so many more parts to look at. In addition, the solar roof tiles require 45% more roof area as compared to regular solar panels. Finally, the challenge of scaling, thermal runaway, thermal safety. As you can see, GAF has, has, has suffered oh, immensely <laughs> after its launch. Tesla has seemingly recognized these challenges and they've shifted focus. They have canceled a huge number of their solar roof tile installs. And Elon Musk is now relying heavily on subcontractors for his regular solar panel business. Tesla Solar or Tesla Energy as they're called is moving towards becoming a technology supplier. They'd rather supply other installers batteries. Maybe they make inverters. They do have an inverter right now, but it's white labeled. Mm -hmm. Their solar panels are also white labeled. But with Elon sacrificing market share in solar installations, it is clear that the solar roof tile market is a difficult nut to crack. So it might be wiser to stick with traditional solar panels until these roof tie technologies can overcome the barriers of scale and safety. That's the wrap up for today. If you found this useful, don't forget to hit that like and subscribe. And until next time, stay plugged in.